John, and I'm Johannes Davies. Welcome to Ace Ambrit Commentary Evaluation Broadcasting. Now, we just saw the best game, probably, of the girls' um, tournament. It, it was a nice game, wasn't it? That was it? an exceptional game, John. It was incredible. Of course, everyone already had money from Georgia's team, and they played very well. But to see the results, you'll have to keep watching. We're moving into December, so the weather's a bit hot, but dry at the same time. You have to understand the players' fatigue at this point. They played non-stop for three days. Well, let's go see the highlights. Well, football fans, it really started to get heated in this game shortly after cookout when Georgia was able to get the ball and race down the field to a point where it was just her and the keeper and tap that ball right in to draw first blood. Alex actually kicked that ball away. Georgia ran down the entire middle field, dodged every single thing that came in her way. That was an exceptional goal. A brilliant counter attack by Napoli. Now they just have to do that. I need to keep it already. And here's another exceptional piece. You can just tell how exciting this game was. So here again, we see Georgia take the ball and go and dodge past all the defenders and take a nice shot against the keeper. It was beautiful. Here, let's take a closer look at that shot as it just sails past the keeper. Now this put Napoli in a very comfortable position of 2-0. Now if we look here, Sofia Borghese gets fouled horribly by Izzy. Now look at it slowly. Sofia Borghese literally just flies up in the air and falls down. This did not lead to anything, however. The Green did have some nice shots here, two of them. Just, they were just unlucky. They really had some nice shots. Good opportunity. Well, in that situation, Johan, she could have shot a little bit more to the left because the keeper, Alexandra, did not seem so ready to catch it. So, halftime is cold and the score is 3 nil. Very good playing on all sides. We're going to ask Jawan on his opinions on the performance of Georgia. She seems just to be everywhere getting robbed me from the others. Scoring goals who had a great free kick. These two teams are really going head on, battling it out hard. But my question is, can the green team really keep this fighting up? There's 3 0 down. That's a low morale for that team. If they can fight, if they can fight back, I will be truly, truly impressed. So, the second half starts with a score of 2 0. Now here's a very important play, Georgia just falls right down. That was very important because it led Georgia's team to the third goal. I think if the green team can shut Georgia down, they've, they've done a huge part shut the Napoli attack. But as long as they can't they can hold on to Georgia, get the goal. they won't be able to get do much. Because Georgia really is the goal. She's the difference in this game. She's the time of ball. Here we see Georgia's third goal. Georgia's fourth goal should have looked like all of the others. She was able to get by the defender and just take a really nice angle shot from the right side and just get through the keeper. Georgia just blasting her way down the wing. No one can stop her. And here, the ears are crossed. Well, that, that hits Sylvia and just gets out. Sylvia got lucky that she has to be very careful next time. Here's another example of the green team really trying to get through to get a goal, but the blue defense is just overpowering and they can't get by. Now the final goal happened with a nice throw in by Georgia right to Sofia Borghese, who just tapped it right into the goal for the fifth and final goal of this match. Really nice, a good way to end the game for Napoli. So the final score is 5-0, Georgia with four goals. So Napoli walks away with the championship with a very nice final game. But we want to know more, so we went and interviewed Georgia. I think it was really, really um, nice and it was quite hard on both sides. How does it feel being an intramurals champion? I don't know, it's just normal. But you really, you really played good in this game. Was there something that you did differently that you haven't done in other games? I tried to shoot more and harder. Well, good job, Georgia. You are watching Ace with John and Johannes. Thank you for joining us. See you next time. We don't know who the player of the match is, but it would be a disappointment if it wasn't Georgia.